Little Cook's Co. sent me a free box. Um, it's not sponsored or anything like that, it's just a free, it's a freebie. And, it's, and it was very nice of them because I said Pudge likes cooking. Um, and it's a, a monthly cooking kit for kids aged 3 to 8, delivered direct to your door, helping them to love cooking and eating healthy food. So it's a monthly subscription box, a cooking one. I haven't opened it yet, look. So we'll see what's in it. And uh, then I'll show you snippets of the kids enjoying it. But thank you, Little Cooks Co, for sending me that. I thought I'd better read you a better blurb than the one I just have. Give you an idea of what it's about. It says, Our story, Little Cooks Co is the UK's first healthy cooking kids cooking kit for kids these lovely little boxes offer quality time with children away from screens and distractions while cooking up something yummy and healthy together designed by helen a registered nutritionist each monthly box contains an easy to follow recipe and all the dry organic ingredients perfectly measured out to make it oh that's good you get the ingredients with it because you know normally when you buy science kits it's got none of the none of the stuff you need in it and then you have to buy more, spend more money buying the ingredients. So if that's got the ingredients in it, I'm really impressed. Free from, refi free from refined ingredients like sugar and gluten. Oh, yeah. These lovely kits make cooking with kids fun, easy and healthy. So not only do you get the ingredients, this stuff that's suitable for everybody to eat. Like free from healthy stuff. Children who cook are less fussy, eat more veggies and learn essential life skill. How to feed themselves. Well, I won't disagree with that one. But alongside these important benefits, we hope that our boxes offer opportunities for connection. So many of us recall helping in the kitchen as some of our happiest childhood memories. And we want our boxes to help create as many of those precious moments as possible. Well, that looks good, doesn't it? Here's some of the photos, aren't they? I'm going to open it on my own just because I've got four kids. It might get noisy and you won't see what's in it properly. But then as soon as I've opened it myself and had a look... I will um, show the kids and we'll all make it together. I think this is some of the things you make. Oh, I love them. I'm really pleased they sent me that. Because, as you know, my oldest pudge loves cooking. Oh, internet. I ask you. Right, let me try and open it. You'll have to excuse me. I've only got one hand or the hand's holding camera. It's a little cook's towel, I say, look. And I promise kids that they can have it as soon as I've looked. Rocky Road. Oh, I've never made them. These yummy bites are perfect for school snacks and lunch boxes because they are nut free. They contain a mineral called potassium, which is an electrolyte. This means it helps conduct electrical current around our bodies. Yep, we are electric. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, that's cool because it gives a bit of science in it, doesn't it? The things you're consuming. And then there's all the recipe ingredients and what have you. I really like this, you know. <laughs> Look how it's nicely wrapped up. And there's a pencil with it, look. Little Cook's Co. Oh, what lovely. I'm trying not to rip it too much. The kids don't want to. I'll have to try and put it back as best as, as, best as it was as I can. But kids. And a little letter, look. Saying, we're delighted you've joined us. Oh, look. A little record workbook. That'd be what the pencil's for, won't it? This month's recipe. What skills have I learned? You can put your picture there if you want. Oh, it's for each recipe lot that you do. Oh, that's nifty, isn't it? Yeah. Sorry for sounding like I'm gushing. Oh, there's more than one recipe lot. Oh, lovely. I know I sound like I'm gushing. It's because... <laughs> Because my oldest loves cooking so much, I know he's going to enjoy this. Rocky Roads. Like I say, we've never made them. My friend Lou loves them, but I've just never made them. So Rocky Roads, and that shows you how to cook it a lot. Micro green smoothie recipe. Can I go at that as well? How to grow your own micro greens. Curried sweet potato cake. Oh, well, I know Pudge will like that. He loves curry. And then what's this? Oh, that must be like we put baking paper. So what we got? Organic alfalfa seeds. 
What's this one? What's your favourite activity for rainy day? World food. Okay. I'm coming, Pinky. Hang on. Sticker. And then some ingredients. I'm going to have to go because Pinky wants me. And it's all organic, look. How lovely. Right, I'll just go get Pinky. And then we'll lay a bash at it. Cacao. Dates. Apricots. Buckwheat. Groats. See, this is all stuff I would never buy. Purely because I've never used it before. Um... We're on a tight budget, so I have to buy things I know we're going to eat. So it, it's a nice way for him, because Gabriel, my oldest, loves trying new things. So it's a really nice way that he can try new things, and it's not going to completely wreck my shopping budget. And then if it turns out everybody does like them, then I can buy them properly, if you know what I mean. It's a good way for him to experience different foods. I'm coming, sweetheart! Yeah, my two-year-old wants me. But a nice day. We've hit a slight bump in the road with our rocky road. Um, you need a blender. We haven't got a blender. I've been texting around friends and none of them have got blenders. But I text my mum and my mum's got a blender. But it's a little handheld one. Uh, which would be better than nothing. <laughs> so she's going to lend us that. So I think I'll just chop the dates up really small if it's a handheld blender. And hopefully that'll be alright then. Freezer ages. I don't think it's meant to be rock hard, just like. 